Hello YouTube family, welcome back. If you're new here, I am Jackie with Mamma Mia DIY. Today I have a Dollar General haul for you. Most of it is mainly fall things. I have a few uh, Halloween things to use. Um, this is from the store that's closest to, not closest to my house, on my way home from work one that way that's closest to my house because I have one that's literally walking distance from my house now. It's been open a couple of months. So first thing we're going to do, it's not fall, it's just farmhouse country goodness as a wooden cutting board with plastic letters. That was $12, but guys, I love it. I have the perfect spot that I want to put this, but let's open it so you don't have such a glare on it. This is what it looks like on the front. It's got the grooves for the letters, and that's what it looks like on the back. So if you didn't want to use the letters, you can always use them this way. But then it comes with the plastic letters that you can put into the grooves. And say happy fall, you can do your menu for the night, you can leave a message. I thought that was super cute. So uh, if I use it as a message board, I might make a little box to keep all the little letters in down and connect it down at the bottom. But I thought that was super cute. And I couldn't wait for it to go on sale, so I just went ahead and got that one. Next thing I got were these beautiful large sunflowers of only three feet, three and a half feet, something like that. But I absolutely love these. These were $6.50. This one has like the curled metal around the center. And this one has the spring looking. But I can't wait to put these out in the front yard. Put my little metal pumpkins out there with them. So yeah, I am so ready to decorate the fall, guys. Next big thing I got is the welcome mat with the white and blue truck with all the fall goodies in the bed of it and the cute little dog that are hanging out the window. It was ten dollars so this is for my front porch and hopefully Luna who I call my Luna horse because she is getting so big does not eat it yeah she has eaten my lemon mat several other doormats that I've gotten okay let's see is that all all of the big bulky things, yes. So next are these cute, cute, cute little scarecrows. You got a little girl and a little boy and they got the little dangly feet. I got these to set on the entryway table, which I might do a little bit of that decorating today, doing my banister and stuff, but I love them. They were five dollars they had another set that was like this cream colored that i almost got but the blue i know it's not exactly the same shade of blue that i'm going with but i love them they were so cute so i picked those up i picked up this cute little candle and this tin 
It's highest in blooms. It's a five ounce candle. It's a single wick. And I want this up in my bathroom on a shelf. And once the candle's burnt, I can clean it out and use it for a little trinket, trinket tray, excuse me. I did buy some garden flags to replace the spring and summer ones for some fall ones. And they were $2 each. And I got this one that says, Welcome to our home with the beautiful sunflowers that would work great with my big bus sunflowers. So that one's going on the one that's right outside off the front porch glyco that I have there. This one is Welcome Fall. That will go on also with sunflowers down a little bit. And this one is Get Thanks with the beautiful pumpkins and sunflowers. I picked those up. So if you saw my last Dollar General haul, I hauled Halloween gnomes. Well, I found some fall gnomes. And there was five different ones. This one has a little sweat sweater pattern and they were a dollar with a little green leaf and he's got an orange body this one has a little leaf he's got the gingham body orange hat and the back of him is black i love these they're great for the tear tray they're great to set up in the windowsill you have a little spot on it shelf or bookcase that needs something. This one, I love the green. He's got the blue. He's super cute. I love him. And then this one with the yellow and his little plaid hat. And he's got, get the tag out of the way. He's got this cute little leather pumpkin. And the next one is this one with the blue. So, He's got a little acorn. Yeah, love those. Those are super cute. The next is this Farm Fresh Autumn Harvest pumpkin. It's really a chunky one. And it was $3. So I picked that up. On the top of my hatch, I do all different shapes of pumpkins and stuff. So that's where that's going. Some fall garland, they were $3. This one is in the orange, white, and neutral, and it has a tag on that side, it's blank. This side has blessed, so you can always do the other side for something for Halloween or Thanksgiving. So pick those up. This one is done in the bluish gray, white and orange you got your tassel and it's got the pumpkin that says thankful but the pumpkin on the back side is plain so you can always paint that up and do something with it this one was three dollars it's this cute little wooden acorn that says welcome it's also another chunky one I just love the leather decals with the little little brads there. This one was a dollar. It says give thanks. It's got the little hanger on it. It's got the wooden beads. But you can easily take those off that break for tear tray, windowsill, shelves, whatever. Next is Farm Fresh Pumpkins. Pick your own. But what sold me, I love this detail with the, the jute and the beads right here. And the pumpkin is like a 2D. And it was $2. Yeah, I could have easily made it with Dollar Tree items, but I liked it, so I got it. And next are three 
shadow boxes. The first one is Farm Fresh Pumpkins with the truck and the pumpkin. And they were a dollar. This one, Fall Breeze and Autumn Leaves. These, again, tear tray, shelf, window sills. And this one is Thankful. I think this one's my favorite with the black and white and the orange pumpkin. So I picked that up. There was four different ones of these. Sorry for the rattling of the bag. It's this blessed one with the orange and gray copper leaf or green stem. They were a dollar. Same thing, tear tray, bookshelf, windowsill, little corner on something. So pick that up for that. This black and white one, thankful, which kind of goes with the black and white on this one. Not so much with the tag, but can always flip your tag over, paint it orange, do something like that. So I picked those up. And the last two are thankful and grateful. But I thought those were super cute. So I picked those up. And the last few things that I got from Dollar General are Halloween related. And it's this pumpkin with the raffia bow, the black wooden beads, trick or treat, little tag. And that's what your pumpkin looks like. And it was $2. So I picked that up. Booze, hisses, and Halloween kisses. You got two little wooden beads. I love that little ghost. The boo is raised. So I thought that was cute for a dollar. And the last that I got there are these cute little skeletons. I have a DIY that's coming up for these. But I thought they were so cute. And they were a dollar each. So that is it for this Dollar General haul. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. All of that helps my channel, helps YouTube see that people are liking my content and they'll suggest my videos more. Uh, and if you're new here, think about subscribing and becoming a part of the Mamma Mia DIY family. Share with your family and friends. Getting so close to that 500, my friends. So we will be doing that giveaway. For those paying attention to that mess right there, that's piled up DIY items. Yeah, I got several I got to get done. So with all that being said, you guys are awesome. I love you each and every one so much. I appreciate all your kind words and your support. So with all of that being said, I will see you when you got it. That's right. In the next video. Bye, guys.